team comes through to be greeted by officials from New Zealand cricket. And Mark's thrilled to see some of his heroes up close. The little man just there, Session Tendulkar. It's number one in uh, one day as in test cricket. Just, um, we're going to escort you down through customs and through pick up your baggage and through agriculture. Um, just wanted to advise you to make sure that you declare all your boots and your cricket gear, your um, cricket bats and wickets and that for agriculture. And if you've got any food, just make sure that you declare it because there's an instant fine of $200 or up to $100,000. Okay, we'll take you on down. Cheers. Is this the first time here? No, it's the second time. You came in 98, 99? Yeah. You might not know this, but um, Mark here is a very keen cricketer. <laughs> he plays cricket for customs. Uh, what do you do, Mark? Oh, we all do a bit of both. Okay. Yeah, a bit of batting, a bit of bowling. The plan is to get the touring party through passport control, customs, and math as quickly as possible. The guy with the turban, he's a spin bowler. What's his name? Harbhajan Singh. Good spin bowler. He either took nine, I think he took nine or ten wickets about two years ago in one innings. Processing the team is going smoothly so far. Where's this car? So, how do you think you're going to go? If we get runs, we'll be alright. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Big tough series. Yeah, one day is yeah. a big run. Yeah, one day. Is, yeah, we play good one day. Good. We play good cricket. Yeah, we're doing really well, mate. Yeah, yeah. 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 exciting. You know, yeah. yeah. Good to be home. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Catch up with everyone. Uh, sorry, but let's go through yeah. the six. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but while most players have heeded Mark's warning and are declaring their cricket boots. The same can't be said for everyone. Man, part of the Indian cricket team, has been asked to um, show his cricket shoes at the bench. He's shown some, but for some reason he hasn't shown his other ones. And it looks like he didn't want to show them because he didn't want to have to repack his bag. So we're just having a look through here now to see what we can find. Are they going to pack my luggage again? Are they, are they TV? I don't know. Are they? They, the they have to. Here is yeah. that just a by math, but there's already been an upset. This dude's got heaps of cricket shoes and stuff, and right. he's, he's been sent to the beach and, and asked to um, show all his shoes and things. Right. And he hasn't. And the reason he's given is because he couldn't be bothered repacking his own bag. Uh, okay. And uh, obviously that's not good enough. So, uh, right. so some, well, needs, let's, let's some obviously about. need to be cleaned. Yeah. And sure. then. Um, all of them need to be cleaned. going to get for them. Yeah, that'd be great. Off spinner Harbhajan Singh a.k.a. the Turbinator, has been trapped leg before by failing to declare several pairs of cricket boots. Besides unwanted grass or seeds, the mud on these boots could carry dangerous pests or diseases. About eight or ten feet so far that need to be cleaned. Okay. Yeah, obviously that's not good. Yeah. Can we um, start taking them in? Is that all right? Yeah, we'll finish the bag off. Far out. What a day. Blatant disregard, really. That's all it is. Okay. And these are international cricketers. It's just not good enough. It's really not good enough. What? You know, to come through our airport and purposely not be cleaned up just because you couldn't be bothered repacking. Of course, they can't be bothered. No, well, that's not good enough for our country. Okay, we've got a lot to protect here. The fans and photographers are waiting patiently for the team to appear. But this player isn't going anywhere just yet. How long is it going to be? Just, we have to clean all the shoes and stuff yet, yeah. and I'm going to issue them as infringement notice. Right, okay. Then. Will it be a fine or? Yeah, two hundred dollars. All right, same as everybody. They're, just because they're international cricketers doesn't make any difference. That's fine. Yeah. Can I get him to bring all his luggage down this way? Yeah. Thanks. Got to bring it down here, Hubbard. Yeah. <laughs> shoes, eh? Not good, man. You know. Obviously, quarantine's a, um, not an issue where he comes from, but for our part of the world, it certainly is. You know, it's, it's unacceptable, and uh, I don't really care who he is. He still gets a fine. Okay, so here's the option available to you right now. Yeah. 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 yeah, but these are your options. You need to choose one. Here you go. Just 
speak to my manager. I'll just ask him. Okay, where's your manager? Uh, I'll need to call him. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You need a new And so the team's manager has to stump up two hundred dollars to pay Havajan's fine. Just wait, huh? Okay. Let's go now and get changed. I can't be bothered doing all this. When they'll come to India, they'll come to know what. You waiting for your shoes? We let them go straight away from the airport to the hotel. I don't want to come here again, man. Seriously, this is ridiculous. We are not thieves. By cleaning the Indian cricket team's gear inside and out, grass in the bat box mud on the shoes, and it's all got to go. At the infringement counter, Habajan Singh's been fined $200 for failing to declare dirty boots. Hopefully surf into New Zealand in the future, you be a bit more careful, OK? I don't want to come here again, eh? That's your choice, sir. <laughs> Hopefully your management can Australia maybe, a better in, maybe inform you a bit better, too. Australia's a better option, I think. That's fine, sir. Um, this is the notice, it's all taken care of, okay? There's no record goes on your passport, okay? That's your information you on your passport back, sir. Thank you. Thank you. So, Dexter, please. Dexter. Where I'm getting my shoes? Am I, am I getting them? Yeah, yeah, yeah it's on the outside. I'm getting them? Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. It's been a long wait, but the fans' patience is finally rewarded. Would that be you? We want you to take more wickets out here. Thank you very much. Habajan may not be a big hit with math right now, but he's treated like a rock star by his fans. Out the back, things are slightly less glamorous, as boots, boxes, bags, bats, and still more boots are scrubbed to within an inch of their life. Oh yeah. It's a dirty job, but for the sake of our biosecurity, math's got to do it. It doesn't matter how many times you tell them to declare stuff, they uh, still don't do it. I told them upstairs they're going to lose an instant fine for not declaring sports gear and food. You declared this, these items? Yeah. Who did you declare it to? We told the lady there. What did you say to her? That we have uh, milk powder for the baby and... And not even the captain's immune from the math attack. Um, this gentleman here has declared three pair of cricket shoes. Yeah. Okay. He's declared, he's told us about three pair of cricket shoes. Yeah. Cricket shoes, uh, that means with spikes in the underneath, isn't it? Yeah. I, I have three pairs Surav of Ganguly has declared his cricket boots, but not his trainers, and the umpire isn't having a bar of it. He's told us that he's forgotten about the, this pair. Okay. Um, by not doing so, by not declaring it to the officer when asked, um, he's just committed an offence under Act as your previous play ahead. Um, so unfortunately it's going to be the same same scenario. And once again, it looks as though the manager will have to dig deep. But Surav isn't hanging around. He heads out to his adoring fans, leaving the manager to pick up the tab. It's not a, not a brilliant start to the, the trip. No, it's, it's excellent. <laughs> the, the manager is actually taking responsibility for the, the team's actions, which is probably very good of him and has paid uh, the two subsequent fines that the team has encountered. Oh. 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 There's something which has not been done purposely. It can happen with anyone. Just give you a receipt and you'll be on your way. Even the same mistake could have been done by the US president, you see, carrying three pair of shoes or four, you don't remember. Him as well. Yeah, that's fine. I'm not objecting why you were fined. I'm not objecting. I'm objecting the intention. I never said. Why you are fine? I have no objection to it. Okay, well, you know, pop these shoes in to get clean, okay. and I'll right. give this to your uh, player. Right? Okay. Thank you. Thank I'll, you. I'll, I'll take it. The team's due to fly to Christchurch this afternoon, but they can't transfer to the domestic terminal until all their gear has been cleaned. So day one in New Zealand, and all in all, it's been a mixed result. I mean, we told them, we told no, I know. them, you know, numerous times. Uh, yeah. Like, so, you know, I might just get a take a meth officer up as well and they can sort of tell them different uniform might do something, who knows. OK, take care. Right, See you, mate. No worries. The manager's $400 down and his players haven't made any new friends in the quarantine service. And the visitors' fortunes didn't improve. Faster batsman Tendulkar got caught on the crease. They lost both tests against the Black